Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. I'm Mover C.W. Lemoyne, author of the Spectre series and the Alex Shepard series. If you like books, pick one up. It does help support the channel. Today, uh, I got a lot of requests to do this Sherdill uh, trailer, dogfight scene, or whatever. So uh, I'm going to do another re re Mover Ruins Movies reaction video, and uh, we'll see how the... Uh, I don't know, is this Bollywood? Uh, it's Pakistani, so the Pakistanis, what their take is on a, a fighter pilot dogfight scene. So uh, here we go. Let's watch a clip from Sherdil. So we'll do the same thing as we did last time. We'll run through it run real quick uh, in real time, and then uh, I will stop and play back stuff that I see. NK Pictures. All right. JF 17s. All quiet on the border, sir. All quiet on the border, sir. This has got subtitles. Subtitles. Hey, fan. Hey, fan. Never get tired of Wait, 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 wait. Stop, 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 stop. I understand this. Can I speak or do now? This is, this is English? All right. All right, so they're jibber jabbering. Literally is on standby for us today. Can I ask you something? Wait. Uh oh. I've got a missile lock. Missile lock. On the score. Six o'clock. It's on your six. I see it. Sure, Sure, Dill. Break, break, break. Break, break. Go the opposite direction. Uh oh. It's still on me. Here it comes. Here it comes. It's close. It's coming around. Uh -oh. oh, it's it's the behind enemy lines. It's chasing him. Yep, it's gonna chase him around. Punch the tanks. Nice, just like behind enemy lines. And now there's a two ship sh shooting him. The wingman. Not again! Oh no! Another missile! Obviously not shot by the two that's chasing his wingman. Uh oh, it's Top Gun. You gotta do what? Copy that, Sherdale. So he's being chased. Oh god. And the slow mo. Uh oh. So the missile that was chasing him now blows up the trail mirage. Alright. And now he's still getting gunned. Uh oh. Two of them. And they're gunning him again. Nobody uses missiles. This will be over before it starts. Ooh, that's cool. Friends with the sky. Oh. Why? Who is telling him this? He's got a Wizzo, but there's no one in the back seat. They're useless. Too close for missiles. And no. Hitting the pickle button to sh shoot the gun. Oh, good. I'm glad he's going to make it home. He was just trying to kill you, but... Maverick has the ball. Tally one. Oh, slow-mo. Is, is he dead? Is he dead passing? Oh, he's going to have neck problems. The Mirage guy's dead. Oh, they know each other. Okay. He's alive. And they're talking. They must be jibber jabbering on guard, like the Navy. Uh oh. The sky is mine. Uh 
Oh, I don't understand that. That must have been a different language. Oh, he's... What are you waiting for? Sorry, I don't want this. Oh, the wingman's in trouble! So you're using Link. I mean, that's newer, I guess. Good on him. Hold your course. Nice. Oh no! Fan is hit! And that's the end. Oh, sad. Okay, it's, uh, let's go back and look at some stuff. All right, before we get started, I think I've seen something else about this. I, let's not do the CGI or if it's real, it's mostly CGI. So let's just get that out of the way now. Spoiler alert, this is CGI. But let's talk about some things in this that I saw. So they're, they're obviously doing a patrol or something and just jibber jabbering, which I mean, yeah, usually we don't talk that much. I mean, maybe in Pakistan they do, but it's usually not a, hey, can I tell you something? Yes. Something I never told you and I waited until we were in formation. Oh, you wanted to ask him something. Missile lock. So, is it a SAM? No, that's an air-to-air -air missile. So, I guess somebody fired a missile at him. They're doing flares, but this thing chases him around. Missiles don't do that. That's not a that's not a thing. You don't you don't get chased around by the missile. It either guides and fuses or it decoys off or it blows up in a prox fuse, which I'll talk about here in a second cuz that's how missiles work. But uh, you definitely don't do this. And I know it's for drama and for TV, so it's not a big deal. Punch it off the tanks. If it's an IR missile, I guess maybe, but the flares are going to be more effective and it should have decoyed off, you know, immediately. So, probably not. So he's got this grand plan where he's going to split the formation. It's standard Top Gun ripoff. You're going to do what? Um, I'm going to stop it right here and show you something. So the missiles right here, missiles use proximity fuse, a little radar in the, in the seeker. So once it gets within a certain amount of range from the aircraft, it fuses. So this little plan that he has probably just blew up both aircraft, or at least the warhead detonated between both aircraft. It did, probably didn't blow them up, but it damaged them severely. And then the mirages are gonna run into the fireball. So it's gonna kill everybody in this, in real life. But in their scenario, especially, so they need to decide if these are infrared missiles or, or radar guided missiles because they got their burner lit as the missile. I mean, the missile is just gonna guide right on the afterburner, but uh, with, with prox fusing, this is just gonna blow up both, uh, both aircraft and uh, create a nice little fireball. But instead, our hero's plan is successful. So he, sh he kills him with his own missile. I guess that's cool. Here we go again with the missile launch indications. And this is where he meets his buddy and I guess that's the whole point of this movie, is they're buddies and fighting in a war. Uh, this will be over before they get there. That's straight out of Top Gun. We're sending the alert, launching the Alert 5. No, this will be over. Maverick Supersonic, I'll be there in 30 seconds. I don't know what friends with the sky means. That was in English though, I think. Why does he need to tell Mirage? They're visual, aren't they? Like, why are they talking so much? And here, he's got he's got air-to-air -air missiles. Just Fox 2, kill, done. He hits the pickle button, but I don't know of any aircraft. I mean, there might be where you hit the pickle button and the gun shoots, but it really should be the trigger. And um, he should just Fox 2, done. I'm out. The gun is for drama. But I, I guess he wanted him to live? I don't, I don't know. So this is where he sees his buddy. And right here, I've never... You have to be really damn close to see the dude's eyes. I'm pretty sure that guy's dead. His, his, he's dead. That guy's not alive. His eyes are... He's off. He's not alive. But I guess he comes back to life here in a second. But... So 
See, he looks alive. So they recognize each other somehow, and look at look at all these missiles he's got. Why are they shoot the damn missiles? I don't. Oh, sure deals his name or call sign. Never wanted 360, so they're in a two-circle fight. The Mirage. Guy is mine. I okay. Just cheesy. See, that was not in English. He comes around and again. Just shoot the damn missile. Why are you waiting? Well, he does nothing. It's his buddy. He doesn't want to kill him. And now his, you never leave your wingman. It's one of those threats. Like, I could have killed you, but I didn't. And see right here, as he's rolling in, he could Fox 2, Fox 3, pop off a air-to-air -air missile and uh, take off the dude on his tail. Instead, they get into this weird little chase in the mountains, which looks cool. But, you know... He gets gunned. He should be janking. Fan's dead. And that's the end of Sherdell. So, sad. I guess there's more movie to it. So, this is Pakistani. I mean, of course, it's a movie. I'm not going to ruin the whole thing. Um, but, yeah. Oh, boy. Um, yeah. It's cool. It's all CGI. And I'm pretty sure of that because the VFX guy actually commented on one of my other videos. And I looked at his page and it's a making of... Sherdill and how he did the VFX. So I don't think there's any body saying that this is 100% real uh, or whether they used any real airplanes. It looks real. I mean, it looks really good. So kudos to you. That that really looks awesome. Uh, but, you know, as far as movies go, you know, you could pick it apart all day long, but it actually, I mean, probably pretty entertaining. You know, it's not that bad. It could be a lot worse. And you know, with cheesy commentary and all that stuff. I mean, it's not a documentary. Nobody expects these to be documentaries, but it is kind of funny, kind of the way they try to do stuff. So anyway, that's my take. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Send me more. Uh, there, I, a lot of people want me to do the French one, uh, which I've never seen, and there's a return to base version that I've also never seen. Uh, so maybe we'll do that. And of course, there's the original Top Gun, but I wasn't around in the 80s, so I don't, um, I was, but I was like four. So I don't really know what life was like back in the Top Gun days. But anyway, we'll, we maybe we'll do some, maybe I'll get Gonky on board and we'll do some uh, Top Gun reaction videos in building up, which by the way, the Top Gun uh, Maverick watch party is gonna happen. I am 100% confident we're gonna be able to do it. Details still TBD, but I think it's gonna be a thing and I'm very excited because we're gonna raise money for Folds of Honor, which they will be able, to, uh, they are excited about. So definitely gonna be a, a charity event for Folds of Honor. Uh, I can say that now. So hope you guys will join me here in New Orleans to watch uh, Top Gun Maverick. It may not be opening weekend, but uh, we're still working out the details. So hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Excuse me, no, no. Oh! I've met a lot of them. Oh, God. I'm not going to have one. I'm going to play fire with the doors off. Oh, fuck. Don't be a douche. Rule number one. Make them tell you now.